Hey, what's up? So we just landed in San Francisco. I think Maverick's taking a potty break right now. But uh, yeah, we're heading over to Kindred Motors. Check out their- This blurry little figure right here, that's Mav. He's the president and co-founder of Legacy EV. And here's a better picture of him. Their facility, hang out with Rob a little bit, some of his guys. Alright, so we got a little problem here. We're on a tight schedule and the line for our rental car is like out the building and probably gonna take us an hour to get a car so we're crossing our fingers right now hoping that Maverick is a gold member at Hertz and we he's in line right now. We'll see. We'll see if he is. Do you think yeah. you're a gold member? I'm pretty sure I'm a gold member. I've done this before, but it's not showing up on the reservation, so we're gonna have to wait and see. Maverick? Yep. Square pull star? Yep. Most I don't know. Could you just push the button? <laughs> <laughs> What's up everybody, we're here at Kindred Motors uh, with Rob Howard, CEO. Uh, we're gonna be walking around the shop. I don't know, is there anything you wanna? We're just happy to have you guys here, Rob. And you and your team, an important partner of ours and looking forward to working together. Awesome, yeah. let's, let's look around, I'm excited. To, yeah. This is probably one of the coolest buildings that I, I've been in. We're, I don't know, we're gonna walk through it. I'll have more to say about that. <laughs> well, this is, uh, this is like the showroom basically. It's really the corporate offices and at the far side, we'll have the configuration so customers can come in and kind of configure their cars. Oh, cool. Choose the color, leather, choose the wheels, you know, choose the color of the car itself. Go for a test drive, uh, things yeah. like that. Do you guys have any other yeah. offices anywhere else, or is this, nope. this where everything is? Nope, it's all here, yep. Yep. This is final assembly. Okay. So, huh. we have, uh, we have, we got one of our test Broncos is a gray Bronco. That's what's left of it. Okay. So we built several Broncos up, tear them down and back up again, and then did all the testing on it. Mm -hmm. And after testing, you got to tear it all the way down again to find out exactly what went well and what did it. Mm -hmm. So this one now is, is blown up. Okay. Uh, and it start, reassembly for this starts, I believe, tomorrow. Okay. And in two weeks, it'll be reassembled back into a beautiful gray Bronco. Okay. And then the, that finalizes our blueprint. So now we got it all done. So this is where final assembly comes together. So okay. it's not an assembly line. Yeah, I was gonna Work ask is her. done in different areas, okay. inventory, and then it all comes back to here. Okay. You get a sneak peek of our future models. <laughs> I don't want to share that. That's uh, the first customer Bronco. Okay. Right there. All right. So those guys are about to put it in the paint. And then yep. these are Broncos. These are you know original uh, chain of custody on original band This is just a boneyard, you know, it's when cars come in before they get torn down. Um, this is how they come in, basically. We have, like I said, probably three dozen Broncos in house, a couple dozen buses in house right now. So this is, you know, all stand in, stand out. You know, you can see there's four or five of every single part, basically, mm -hmm. for the first build of Broncos this year. It's all in house already. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you can't screw around with this. Like you have to know exactly what you have at all times. As you know, you can yeah. this. Yep. Mm -hmm. So our inventory guys are all over this. Mm -hmm. yeah. it's great. I didn't know you were gonna use this space. You didn't use this space? What? I want to keep that space. Oh, oh I don't know. I was just referring court. to oh basketball court. <laughs> yeah. Somewhere we need yeah, yeah. yeah. specific story yeah. or outside. We can still play with a few things. Yeah, yeah. yeah. totally. Know, try to... These are Bronco frames, unmolested. We we stripped them. But what'll happen is, here's, come on over here, you'll see this. These are Kinder design parts that are modifications to the frames that are necessary to take the new engine and all the other things, mm -hmm. right? So these six or more parts are Kinder design. 
and we'll essentially, we have a blueprint that says take that, cut that off, put this on, mm -hmm. and you know, within a couple hours, we've got all three of these things ready for, yeah. for Kinja. Orange yes. one was our first prototype one. It's almost outdated now, so we've got to kind of put it back through the process to get it up there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, what this is a, uh, now we're moving into design. We'll have a wall here eventually probably, but this is a design group. So they're forever more doing the next model. So they're all focused on the 20, the 3100 and the bus now. Nice. So that bus, we weren't happy with the front suspension. So the engineer's been working on improving that so it has better handling and better suspension. We're putting actually power steering in it too. Right. Because it just wasn't, awesome. yeah. it wasn't as, as, as modern a feel as we wanted on it. Right? Yeah. What do we have here? The little three wheel guy. Oh yeah. Uh, that's, that's, that's the electric go cart. Yeah, that's the guy. Uh, he's not the guy around the building. Gonna get lazy. <laughs> that's Like the four reverse switch. All these cars. So. I mean, yours is the most uh, it might be here. that. Oh. It's fun. <laughs> yeah, that is fun. Yeah. Well, I'm assuming. I mean, is this steering and that's throttle? Man? Yeah. Correct. Yeah. That's funny. Yeah. What happened to your roof? It blew off on the way here. I gotta. <laughs> I, I got gotta it. Down. Yeah. You gotta slow down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this thing goes eight. Yeah. <laughs> uh, were you looking for this thing when you found it, or? No, I was on a mountain bike ride in, okay. in Marin County, and I was just sitting there. Okay. And you know, something just called you, and I said, I gotta have this thing. It was <laughs> yeah. in the mud, you know, and I just put a note on it. Yeah. A guy, a year later, a guy called me. A year later, he calls you from a note you left on it. Wow. Did you have to put the note in a Ziploc bag, or how did <laughs> it I, 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 No, I, I'm surprised. I went back, and I put another one on. Okay. Because I never heard from him, and yeah. then, like, yeah, a year later. Oh, it's underneath. It's underneath. I kind of hit it. You know, it's. You can see it. Yeah, it's old school. You can oh, see yeah. it from the <laughs> lead sled. Yeah. Um, That's very cool. The only thing in there yeah, is the motor. Yeah, the ultra controller right here. Yeah. Right. The red bus over there is our. This this was a very early prototype. I don't know if you've seen this bus before. I have. I've seen it yeah. a few times actually. Uh, Holy high voltage, wasn't it? At Holy high voltage. So this yeah. was the first. You know, it's a it's a Tesla small drive, and but uh, but it was just a proof of concept. Of, yeah. yeah, like we need to have an EV to show people and totally you know, drive around. So now now as we're preparing to build the actual production one, we're using this as a test fuel. So we're going through and uh, the battery packs, motors completely different, obviously, but uh, we're playing around with different front suspension. Yeah. Uh, uh, power brake booster, uh, Bosch eye booster. I, too. I think that this is a really good sign for where the aftermarket's at and conversions and upcycling vehicles in general. Like, this is a huge operation for yeah. restoring classic cars. Yeah. Um, okay, I think for me, getting to see the bus, the truck, the team, mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah, this is just, they got a lot of good things going here. Yeah, and the way they're doing it is super cool. It's so sequential with their blueprint mm -hmm. sequence. Mm -hmm. So they're really dialing in the process of taking something with all this history that's already been manufactured and then mm -hmm. finding a new useful life to get for it again with all this style. Like, yeah. Yeah. that's gonna be the coolest EV on the road, that bus. Like, yeah. Everybody's gonna freak out about it. And yeah. they're gonna have that in production, which is amazing. Well, they have a great team, so I think showing up and getting to eat lunch with them. Yeah, we all we already knew Rob and you Seth, but right. um, I'm I'm impressed. All right, well, with that, I think we're out of here. This one's a wrap. <laughs>